when the CDC says this season's flu vaccine has offered substantial protection across all age groups. However, we are about to enter the month of March, and many may wonder if it's too late to get the vaccine. CBS 4's Jeremiah Marshall spoke to doctors about this concern. We had a big peak a little bit earlier than usual in November, uh, but it usually doesn't go away until after May. Health experts say we are still in flu season. People must be vigilant and take good care of themselves. Late September to early October is typically when flu season starts and ends in the summer. But at times there could be an increase in amount of cases in March with many having spring break on their minds. Some years we've seen a little bit of a bump uh, around March, maybe related to the travels and spring break, uh, but it's usually not as big of a bump uh, as what we had earlier in the season. According to the CDC, the flu vaccine has provided substantial protection for all age groups, and this includes the elderly and the immunocompromised. Here in the Valley, many will soon travel or visit the area for spring break. Cameron County Health Authority Dr. James Castillo says before you head to your destination, you want to make sure you are fully protected. You're going to be traveling, you know, gathering lots of people. There's a risk you can um, come into contact with somebody with the flu, so you want to make sure that you have the most protection you can, you can get, and that's through the flu vaccine. And as the flu season continues and you still haven't gotten your flu shot, Dr. Castillo says you can still do so. It's not too late to get the flu vaccine. Uh, it's still around and um, everybody who it's indicated for uh, should get it, but especially those uh, people who are at biggest risk for the most severe complications of the flu. Working for you, I'm Jeremiah Marshall.